think actually that's probably a question better directed at pointing our boss. <laughs> so, <laughs> see, say, if I take the example of the Triple Seven X, and we, we absolutely wanted to follow the Triple Seven X, I think that's a matter of public record. Um, we believe we've been a very good engine for the Triple Seven X, but Boeing made the decision, and Boeing are the customer, and Boeing decided to retain their sole source um, contract with General Electric. And, I'm sure General Electric will do an excellent engine and it will be an excellent aircraft. Um, so it's, we're kind of victims of that decision process. And I don't believe that any of us have actually cancelled out of such a competition. So probably a good question for Boeing uh, and Airbus. The only thing that I would add is that a, a one-engine aircraft versus a two-engine aircraft um, isn't necessarily a, to, at a disadvantage with the airline, because when you when you are single single sourced on an, air, on an aircraft, there's a lot of optimization that can be done for customer value, both in terms of pricing and servicing, just on the business side, as well as on the product side. So when you have two engines, if if an airplane manufacturer, which is the two or three three engine manufacturers, and they want them all to be the same. That may actually be a worse scenario for what the product does for the customer. So you should got to keep that in mind. I agree with that with what Bob said. One thing I think is a misnomer by customers is they feel like they have better negotiating power uh, with engine manufacturers and they've taken we've they've been able to have one of that degree of freedom removed if they don't have a choice. Trust me, the airframers work on behalf of the customers when we work these exclusive agreements and I mean, this was a battle with, with Rolls-Royce on the 777X, and it might, you know, the industry might not have felt that, but I can tell you, GE felt that hard, and, you know, they, they worked those things. So, I, the customers are getting just as good a deal from, from the engine side, even if they did have a, a dual engine side. Now, they don't know that, and they don't see it, but, you know, it's, it's one of those things that, that the airframe really tries to protect. They're making a choice.